In this video, you'll learn how to plane down the end of round logs. Doing so will allow you to join them together securely and quickly. Caution, this job requires protective gloves, closed footwear. To make a flattened plane, you will need a small axe, a file, a bow saw. You will also need two wooden logs and a chopping block. This technique can be done in two steps, which we'll outline for you. Step one, mark references. Place one of the logs on top of the other. Leave a thumb length margin from the end. Use your ax to mark the position of the top log onto the bottom log. Put the unmarked top log to one side. Step two, saw. Saw at the mark to one third of the depth of the log. You don't need to saw too deep. This will weaken the log. Try to saw parallel to the ground to ensure your cut is straight. Step three, hollow out the log. Hollow out the log from the mark you have sawed to the end of the log. You can ask someone to help you by holding the log. Strike the ax down vertically. Bring the log into a horizontal position little by little. Do the same for the second log. You will end up with two plane surfaces which can fit together easily. Step four, assembly. Use your file to help you smooth down the plane surface. This plane joint will prevent round logs from rolling or slipping. To fasten the two logs together, you could include a mortise. See our video on making a mortise for more on this. You could equally tie it with a square lashing. See our video on the square lashing for more details. Now you know how to plane down wooden logs for joining.